Hello, YouTube fam. Big Poppy coming at you. Today is a special day. It's the first day of Chile in Texas. Yeah, in Big Poppy's house. Yeah, Big Poppy finna make some Texas red. And we ain't putting no stinking beans in it. That ain't no real Texas chili. All right. We're going to do it the easy way. I got five pounds of ground beef here. I have a tablespoon of black pepper. I got a tablespoon of oregano and a tablespoon of cumin. I have a tablespoon of paprika. I have a tablespoon of onion and a tablespoon of garlic. I have a half a tablespoon of cayenne. I got a tablespoon of uh, salt and I got a cup of chili powder. I have two cans of tomato sauce and a can of diced tomatoes. Now that's all just to start. We're going to adjust it as we go along. So first, we're going to get this over in the back. We're not cutting up onions in it and all that stuff. You know, we're not doing all of that. We just want meat. That's all we want. Good old beef. Texas style. Big poppy style. That's what we want. We don't want no beans. We don't want stinking beans in our chili. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to move you over here to my pot. Yeah, we're going to put it in that pot right there. We're going to go ahead and get us a flame going up under the pot. We're going to brown our ground beef in this pot. That's what we're going to do. My hands are already clean. Hope y'all are having a good day over there, wherever you are. Because I know I am. I'm going to eat me some chili. Make me five pounds of chili. I normally make ten. But I don't have enough freezer bags. And I'm not going to the store. So I'm going to make five. Let this cook up. That's what we're going to do. Yeah. Have us some Texas red. Texas red chicken. Good and simple. I'm washing little dishes up over here. Make it too spicy. I can cut my serrano peppers up in it the way I like it. It's not gonna make it spicy. My family don't like spicy chili like I do. Yeah. We're going to do it up. Turn this flame down just a little bit. Yeah. 
Now, when it comes to your liquid, you can add beef broth, or you can just plain add plain water. Anywhere it goes, it's gonna work out. Anywhere it goes, it's gonna work out. We're gonna let that just go on and brown up. Make us a big pot of chili. Yes, sir. Get this other wrapped up over here. And Big Poppy gonna get back with you. Okay, fam. I'm back. I'm back. We got a little water in here. Yep. Now, what we're gonna do, we're gonna open our can of tomato, I mean, tomato sauce. that come up to a boil and then we're gonna add our tomato sauce yeah got some cans of tomato sauce going there the top on there and bring it on up get back with you all right fam i'm back with you we got our two cans of tomato sauce in there we might need another can so we're going to dig it out just in case like i told you we'll adjust it as we go along all right, now we're going in with our seasonings. We got our black pepper. We got a tablespoon of black pepper. We got a tablespoon of oregano and a tablespoon of cumin we got a tablespoon of paprika you don't want to come out there you go then we got us a tablespoon of onion and a tablespoon of garlic, a half a tablespoon of cayenne, a tablespoon of salt, and a full cup of chili powder. We're going to turn this down, let that simmer a little bit. Oh yeah, it's looking marvelous. Yeah, it's looking marvelous. 
get that all mixed in together. And we might have to add some thickener to it. Instead of cornstarch, I'm gonna use flour. But we're gonna let it just simmer for a little while. And then we're gonna give it a taste test. Yes, that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna let it simmer for about, I don't know, what do you say, 20 minutes? Then we're gonna give it a taste test. For the best results, you eat the chili tomorrow. All right. Just gonna turn that down a little more. And just let it simmer. That's what we're gonna do. We got everything in the pot, except the tomatoes. Okay, fam. Big Poppy back with you. We're gonna put some thickener in it. Get this thing going. Yeah. I got, I got me a third of a, a third of a cup of flour that I'm mixing. You see that? Can you see that? Yeah. Then I'm gonna temper it with a little bit of my chili juice. Get a little more, put it in here. I didn't add that third can of tomato soup. When I tasted it a while ago, it tastes pretty darn good to me. So here we go. I'm gonna put this in there. Let it thicken it up a little bit. Got it going on. It's looking marvelous. Yeah, it's looking marvelous. Make sure we keep stirring so it won't develop any lumps. And looking pretty good. Mm-hmm. Looking pretty good, Big Poppy. Now it all depends on how thick you want your chili. I don't need mine too thick because I like to put a lot of crackers in mine. Then sometimes I eat it with cornbread. Yeah, that's right. Cornbread. I'm a cornbread kind of guy. Yeah. But mostly I like it with crackers. We're going to let that just cook up a little bit more. Them cowboys gonna play tonight. I forget who they're playing. 
But we're going to show them a little grace. That's what Jerry said. Say the cowboy is going to show some grace. Yeah, that's pretty good right there. And we're going to turn it down just a little more. We're going to let it simmer about another five minutes. Then we're going to cut it off. Big Poppy going to get back with you. Okay, fam. There we is, my finished pot. You can still see the steam coming from it. It's hot. Yeah, Big Poppy's take on Texas Red. Yeah, with no beans. We don't eat no beans and no chili. That ain't no Texas chili. And here's my plate with my bowl and my little condiments that I will put on there. And got my Louisiana hot sauce, my Heinz ketchup, sour cream, Onions and serrano peppers, green onions and serrano peppers, some cheddar cheese. Yeah, that's Louisiana hot sauce, not Texas Pete. Even people in Texas know the real hot sauce is Louisiana hot sauce. Yeah, that's right. You want some hot sauce, get you some Louisiana hot sauce. Not that Texas Pete. That stuff made in North Carolina. But anyway... It's good, but it ain't good as that. That's some good stuff right there. All right, that's my bowl. That's what Big Poppy going to have for dinner. Going to go back here and watch the Cowboys play. Because they're going to show some grace. And I'm going to be right there watching them show grace. It ain't how you look in the kitchen. It's how you cook in the kitchen. You ain't got to look good to cook good. Get on out there and give me a thumbs up. Like and subscribe. Tell your friends. Tell your enemies. Tell your family. Tell your church. And get on out there and let's get these numbers up for Big Poppy. And keep watching these videos. Go back and watch some of them old ones. All right, Big Poppy out. Peace.